we'll see the Atlanta Hawks going up against the New Jersey Nets. I'm Kevin Harlan with Mike Fratello and Clark Kellogg. On the sideline, David Aldridge. Now here's Williams. Here's Dawkins. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Well, about halfway through the season, Clark, things are starting to heat up for some of the teams we're watching. Yeah, you know, I think they're starting to find their rhythm and get a comfort level, Kevin. You know, coaches have a good idea of the makeup of their team, what Shoot they can two. and can't do, and are really focused on trying to position their teams at this point for a good end of the season and playoff run. And he makes the first. Well, I tell you what, the muscle and athleticism of Daryl Dawkins, a.k.a. Chocolate Thunder, impressive. He always goes full throttle in action and words. No let up in his game. So he picks up just one from the line that time. And he's going up for the alley-oop. It's slammed in by Wilkins. Throwing it down with authority. Easy to see why Wilkins' guys lob it his way. Richardson the pass to Williams. Here's Dawkins. King right side from about 16 and good that time. He saw his opportunity and went right into attack mode. He'll take those mid-range openings whenever they're presented. And to see him doing it at the start of the game is very encouraging for his team. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. He was just a bit out of position on the screen. He tried to make up for it, but he got caught. Always a tricky play to call. But the refs were right on it. Here's Birdsong. His last outing with 20 points. Pass to King. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Hawks. Puts it up off the inbound, and it's Wilkins. That time on the assist by Johnson. This is how dangerous a score Wilkins is. Really capable of connecting right off the catch. Richardson the pass to Dawkins. Fades back. That shot misses. Faded back, but he might have made that a tougher shot than he needed to. At the teardrop, here's Rivers, and it's good. Two points. Doing damage inside, Rivers absolutely fearless. Loves to take it up in there. Richardson outside. Here's the floater, and it's blocked. So it looks like the Nets will retain possession here. A sensational block that definitely deserves another look. Well, I like the fact that's intimidation right away. Got to show those shooters you're going to be in their face all night long. Here's Birdsong. Very solid contribution from him as he averages over 20 points a game. Williams passes to Birdsong. A fadeaway. And again, it's the Nets missing. He tried to use the fadeaway. Get a little space. Not an easy shot to drain. Wilkins kicks to Davis. Down low, Richardson. Here's Williams. And he makes good on the layup. Got to be cognizant of where Williams is, especially on the offensive boards where he's so active. Hawks have gotten their first three shots to go in for him. They start off this game. Rivers passes to Rollins. Wilkins against King. It's Wilkins with the drive. Shoots over King, and the shot is long. New Jersey trailing. Richardson outside. Pass to Dawkins. Pass to Birdsong. Pocket six. Out to the right wing. Here's King. He sinks the 11-footer. Not just a scorer. Birdsong is also adept at finding uncovered teammates. And so it's Rivers with it. He'll bring it up for the Atlanta Hawks. They defeated Indiana in their last game. 
And how about the reserve showing up and giving the starters extra support? I was really impressed by that. Well, we talk about the importance of depth often. They exemplified how crucial having this is during that last game. Again, the Nets for two. Got to guard Richardson from there or he will make you pay. The Hawks trail by three. Rivers surveying the D. It's Wilkins on the wing. Against Indiana, he was really on his game. The Hawks again can hit. For New Jersey, they've gone four for nine from the field to start this game off. No problems knocking that one down. One of the slickest passers in the league. Richardson has no problems getting it to the open man. Atlanta calls timeout. Falling behind in this one, needing a spark. They need to find something that works and stick with it. Cook is checked in for New Jersey. Here's Rollins. Hasn't made one yet. Rivers finds Davis. Rollins with a screen on Richardson. Here's Davis. That's tipped. Here's King. Here's Williams. Great tee that time from Johnson. Defense was right up in his face there. And it spoiled his attempt to lay it in. And here's Davis for three. The rebound by Cook. The Nets on offense. Good momentum. Eight straight points. Richardson. Sweet little floater. Excellent dime from Cook. Loves getting his teammates involved. A minute 20 left to play in the first quarter. Outside, Davis. To the middle. Here's Rollins. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Smart play to save the easy shot. He'll make them earn it at the line. I like the strategy. Make them shoot for it. First trip to the line for him here. Two. Free throw drops for Rollins. Known as a shot blocking big, Rollins' towering presence makes an impact on both ends. Here's what Atlanta's going with right now. Hastings, he's checked in for Johnson. And it's Matthews in for Doc Rivers. That one misses. The Nets on offense. They're on a 10 to 1 run. Here's Cook. And the layup's good off the glass. Hustle play from Cook inside. Taking advantage and finding himself a close range look. Outside, Davis. It's Matthews on the wing. And that one falls coming off of Davis's feed. Davis has got three assists in the game. King, right side. Rebound by the Hawks. 
and usually you can count on him to convert there. The D did just enough to throw him off. On the pass to Hastings. Here's Glenn. Shot clock at six. Davis in the corner. The three. And Jaminski pulls it down. And he lobs it up toward the rim. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Walker. Boy, that looked like a failure to communicate. You hate unforced errors. Here's Kelly. Outstanding D from Johnson. His length causes issues. And so the first quarter is in the books. New Jersey on top as they wrap up the first quarter on a 12 to 3 run. We'll be back shortly live from Omni Coliseum. And hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. And taking a look at the Nets' performance here, guys, uh, what jumps out to you, stats-wise? Their defense has been swarming thus far. I mean, great energy in that first quarter. They've been both disruptive and disciplined. Haven't given up anything easy. Adams dishes to Matthews. And as we know, Clark, in the offseason, there was a sigh of relief when they reached the collective bargaining agreement. Yeah, that can always be a bit tenuous, Kevin, when you're back and forth, no agreement in place. And now, though, there's finally revenue sharing between the players and the owners. Makes them more partners in the whole scope of the big business that the NBA is. And that's actually the first plan of its kind in pro sports. And I think long overdue. And it's Cook missing. That's a quality shot right there. It just didn't fall for him. Hey, they don't all end in scores. Great execution, and they're happy that they had that kind of a chance. Here's Glenn, and he also played a big role in their last game with Indiana. Here's Wilkins over Walker. That's in, and the New Jersey lead is cut down to just four points with a bucket from Wilkins. So quick off the floor. Wilkins uses his absurd 42-inch vertical to grab the board and put it home. Bergsong passes to Walker. Good D by Wilkins. And so it's Matthews with it, bringing it up now for the Atlanta Hawks. They haven't allowed any points in the second quarter. Well, they get the ball to the right guy there. Wilkins gives the transition play a 100% effort. On the wing, Johnson. Good ball movement here by New Jersey. That's the Bergsong. Atlanta with the rebound. Next up in the docket, the Bucks following this one. That'll be the latter half of this two-game homestand. Matthews passes to Adams, and he hits it to tie the game up. Adams has got his first points of the night. Teams love hammering the ball inside and getting easy looks. Out to the wing. Here's Cook. The shot's good on the assist by Walker. So fast once he catches it. I like how Cook measures the defense ahead of time. And now the first timeout called here for the Hawks. I think the coach wants to fine-tune his lineup right here, looking for that magic combination, that ideal combination to be able to take advantage of this opposition. And he needs to let some of these guys catch their breath. Everyone is playing hard out there. So for the Hawks, Rollins checked in for Adams. Johnson comes in for Hastings. And it's Rivers in for Matthews. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Here's Glenn. Still yet to score. Out left to the wing. Just five to shoot. From the strike. 
The Hawks again can't hit. Not quite a block shot, but no question he got a piece of it. It might not add to his stat line, but the offense will certainly be more cautious around him after that. That's what you want from ball movement. Get the defense moving and find the chance inside. Rivers with it. And looking at his production, he averages a little more than seven points a game. Here is Cook. He's guarded by Rivers. Johnson with the block. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. And it's Glenn missing. I think he'll think twice about attempting that shot next time. The defense was right on top of him there. Cook the pass to Birdsong. Here's Williams. And he banks in the layup. Six points for Williams. Look at how Williams uses his length inside, helping him find his way to a shot. It's Wilkins on the wing. Shoots a fader. And once again off the mark by Atlanta. Nets leading by six. Here's Birdsong. Rebound, Wilkins. Atlanta's gone 0 2 from deep here in the second. Passes it to Glenn. There's a minute 40 left now here in the second. Birdsong passes to Williams. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three second violation. Davis has checked in for the Hawks. Kings checked in for New Jersey. The Hawks have gone just 33% from the field in what's been a cold second quarter for them. Just three of nine. Davis finds Rivers. Inside, here's Rollins. And he can't stop this drought. Another miss. Bonnet shooting 43% for the game. Pass to Richardson. Back to Cook. For Davis. Cook, good. Cook's got the lead up to eight now for the Nets. And when you're guarding him, you've got to fight over the top. Lock and trail around the screen and deny the perimeter shot. Davis, the pass to Glenn. Knock loose. And here we go. Richardson heading to the hoop. Drops in the breakaway layup. Richardson's timeout, got timeout. six points. Well, they're cranking it up a notch right now. Are really it? setting the pace for this game. Exceptional in transition. Great job running all 94 feet. Time call here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. And the Hawks making a change here. Wilkins has checked in. There's 42 seconds left in the first half. Davis surveying the floor. To the inside. Here's Rollins and slam dunk by Rollins. At 7-1, that's easy money for Rollins. Wilkins against King. Richards in the pass to King. Dawkins, a screen on Wilkins. Again, the Nets for two. That's an awful defensive lapse, allowing the uncontested jumper. Now Rivers. Johnson sets a screen for Rivers. And looks like the illegal kick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. You know, I admit, there is a little bit of a gray area when it comes to setting screens, but that one was pretty clear cut to me. Yeah, I've got to have your feet set. He did. Easy call for the officials. That'll do it for the first half. Nets lead by 10. We'll take a quick break, then get you back to the action. And we've got third quarter of basketball for you. Two quarters in the books. The Hawks trail by 10. 
outside Davis. The pass to Rollins. King against Wilkins. And it's King with the rebound. New Jersey leading by 10. A step back shot here. Basket counts. King's got it going here in the start of the second half. The first points in the third quarter for New Jersey. Atlanta is shooting just 35%. They've got to get better looks. Rollins with a screen on Richardson. Rivers passes to Rollins. And slam dunk by Rollins. Such an unselfish player. Doc Rivers has the type of attitude you want at the point. Richardson kicks to Williams. The Nets working the ball around now. Pass to Birdsong. Wide open look. Rebounded by the Hawks. You don't get a lot of those chances. He's going to want that shot back. Wilkins dishes to Davis. Back to Wilkins. Misses and he wants that one back. Well, New Jersey shooting at 48% from the floor. Looking good. Here's Richardson. And Dawkins slams it in. Throw it up and let Chocolate Thunder get it done. Right around a minute and a half. Play it here in the third quarter. Oh, and they need a basket in the worst way. I think they're forcing things right now, and it's why their offense looks so pedestrian. Here's Rollins. Yes, that goes in. Rollins got seven points. Not exactly the most solid screen you'll see. Still works, though. Now a timeout called by New Jersey. A lot of answers, but still a lot of questions for how the East is going to ultimately shake out this year. But right now, let's check out where the team stands. You look at New Jersey. Right now, they've compiled the third-best record in the conference. And, of course, Atlanta. They're down in seventh place. Richards in the pass to King. Richardson dishes to Williams. King right side. Looking to get back on track here. Good on the shot. Birdsong's got the lead up to 12 now for the Nets. Not an easy shot to master. Birdsong almost hanging in the air on that mid-ranger. It's Wilkins on the wing. Basket number five goes in. He's now 5 of 12 from the floor. Such a gifted offensive player. He can hurt you in a variety of ways. He's a headache for opposing defenses. Here's Birdsong. He's guarded by Davis. Dawkins, good. This is where Dawkins looks to score. The closer he is to the bucket, the more dangerous he becomes. Now here's Rivers. It's Wilkins on the wing. Whistle blows. Yep, that's going to be a travel. Oh, my goodness. That was not what this team needed. Well, that explains why they're down. Miscues. And now we're three minutes into the third quarter of play. Richards in the pass to Birdsong. Another one falls for New Jersey. Tremendous confidence from Birdsong. You know, that's why defenses have to be right up into him. Otherwise, it's a wrap. Outside, Davis and Johnson now top of the key. It's Rivers on the wing. Richardson cover. Five on the clock. Tipped away. Takes a three. Second chance shot. In the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. Oh, and the jam by Williams. Boy, around the bucket, not much stops Buck Williams. That guy is determined. Rivers passes to Davis. From the high post, two points, that one goes. Room to fire from mid-range, and he's more than capable of knocking that down. Richardson outside. 
Here's Dawkins. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. Dawkins has got six in the quarter. And, you know, they'll take the points, but I'm sure Coach would prefer a higher percentage look next time. Atlanta calls timeout. Both teams will make substitutions. There's a minute 47 left in the third. And here's Rivers. And they call an illegal screen here. It's not that hard to spot an illegal screen. Most of the time, an easy call for the officials. Nets leading by 16. Richardson outside. The shot that time, not on target. Hawks have gone four of seven to get things started here in the second half. Davis inside, rebound New Jersey. Williams has got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Here is Cook, six points for him. 105 left in the third quarter of the game. New Jersey needs to get off a shot here. From deep, Richardson. Out of bounds, it'll go to the Hawks. Not sure who he was looking for there. I know the third row definitely wasn't expecting a pass. Atlanta making some changes. Wilkins has checked in for Johnson. Whitman comes in for Davis. And it's Matthews in for Rivers. There's 53 seconds left here in the third quarter. Glenn passes to Matthews. Passes to Glenn. He feeds it to Matthews. And he gets it to go from the high post. Matthews has got his second bucket of the night. A nice sense of when to move the ball and get the assist. Here is Cook. Taking a look at the scoring numbers right now, he averages about nine points a game. Kept alive. Johnson, the pass to Bergson. Four seconds left. Jump shot is good that time. Birdsong's got six points in the quarter. Nothing wrong with the mid-range, Jay, to keep padding to the lead. Oh, he got it! Nice call. He beats the buzzer! Count it out! Oh, big-time shot! How about that? Woo. Yo! A bomb at the buzzer. How about that? Unreal! Whips this crowd into a frenzy right at the stroke of halftime. And so it's New Jersey looking at a 13-point lead heading into the next quarter. What a night they've had in terms of their shooting. Everything dropping in for them. Back to the end. And there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. New Jersey leading by 13. Fires from the line. Atlanta with the rebound. And the D got super lucky he didn't drain that one. To the paint, here's Matthews. Drops in the layup for two. Got it in close, and that just about always helps. Well, New Jersey shooting at 52% from the field. They're clicking. Here's Cook. Hastings grabs the board. Hastings got six rebounds here tonight. Here's Whitman. Had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. And so it's Walker with it who brings it up for the Nets. Here's Birdsong. Whitman defending. Cook looking it over. Rebound Atlanta. Hastings got rebound number seven for him tonight. 
Here's Wilkins. Yep, that one goes in there. Well, Dominique runs into some tight defense, but sticks with his shot and manages to push through. Nets leading by nine. Walker the pass to Johnson. The Nets working the ball around now. Third song misses. Hawks have gone two or three from the field to get the fourth quarter start. Matthews against Walker. Now here's Matthews. He's guarded closely. Nets have gotten off to a rough start in the fourth quarter, going 0 for 4 so far. Cook the pass to Birdsong. Six to shoot. Hastings grabs the board. Hastings got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Glenn. Walker with the rebound. New Jersey with the ball. Nothing doing offensively yet for them in the fourth. We're in the fourth quarter here. Just under two and a half minutes gone. Jeminski the pass to Walker. Shoots over Matthews. Shots good by Walker. And the Nets lead by 11. And Atlanta has possession. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. Time call here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. Both teams deciding to change it up. And now the latest from our reporter, David Aldridge. Guys, Mike Fratello had some advice for his team during that last break. He told his team they're being too reckless with the ball. He said, you're turning it over left and right. You've got to be smarter and more in control out there. Guys, back to you. Thank you, David. And over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. Rivers finds Davis. Back to Rivers. Offside Wilkins, down to five on the shot clock, and once again off the mark by Atlanta. Nets leading by 11. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points, so one free throw coming up. A scoring guard. Birdsong brings this team serious punch in the backcourt. And what do you guys think so far about the offensive approach for the Nets? Well, you know, they've been tremendous, I think, when What's it comes up? to sharing the basketball. You know, getting guys involved on the plays and creating offensive opportunities for everybody. Equal opportunity offense is fun to watch. They're also finding a lot of points tonight off transition play. Running the floor and using the fast break to beat the defense down the floor. For Atlanta, they've gone just 33% from the field in the fourth quarter so far. They are two of six. King against Wilkins. It's Rivers on the wing. Back to Wilkins. Rebounded by the Nets. Dawkins has got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Birdsong passes to Williams. King inside. Davis is on. Dawkins good. And the Nets lead by 16. And, you know, their lead just continues to grow, and it's not just because of their offense. They're getting it done at both ends. Yeah, their defense has been stellar as well. Great work on both ends. Davis inside. Will it go? New Jersey with the rebound. Here's Birdsong. King outside. One forty-six left in the fourth quarter. It's deflected. This is what Rollins is known for. Such an amazing shot blocker. And there's Davis. That's good on the assist by Rivers. Rivers has got his fourth assist in this one. Nets leading by 14. Stolen by Wilkins. Shoots from the high post. He shoots again. And it's laid in by Davis. Davis has got four points in the quarter. This is what he brings to your team. The ability to turn misses into makes. 
pile up second chance points. Here's Birdsong. He's guarded by Davis. It's stolen by Johnson. Davis against Richardson. It's hauled in by Richardson. For New Jersey, they've gotten only three of their nine field goal attempts to go down since the end of the third. Pretty cold down the stretch. Little to no chance they're able to overcome this deficit. Going to be a good victory for the Nets. They did take higher percentage shots throughout, and Clark had paid off for them. Yeah, it sure did. I mean, I love the patient leading to that consistency shooting the ball. I mean, those things go hand in hand. Patience, good passing, and good shooting. And I think a great job in positioning themselves for the W here. It's win number 21 on the season. And Wilkins gets it to go. And Wilkins can drain the deep ball. For him, it's about shooting these with confidence. Richardson kicks to Williams. Back to Richardson. Nets passing it around. Pass to Dawkins. And again, it's the Nets missing. And not much left to play for at this point, Clark. Kevin, you leave it all out there. You give it your all and let the chips fall where they may. Just was not their night. Richardson outside. And so it's New Jersey with the win. Picking up a road win, Mike, uh, pretty handily tonight. On the road, you usually...